today we got south park man bear pig and if you want to watch my reaction to the entire episode the link to my patreon is in the description below y'all ready for this one let's run it baby let's get it let's go okay students we have a very special guest speaker today who can tell me the name of our country's last vice president dick cheney no the last one bill clinton <laughs> Butters. Please welcome Al Gore. Who? I'm here to educate you about the single biggest threat to our planet, Man Bear Pig. Bruh. Ain't no way, dog. This reminds me of um El Chupacabra. Y'all remember that? That might have been like late 90s, early 2000s. I don't know, bro. It was, it was definitely a minute ago. But anyways, I got to ask y'all this, right? I remember Al Gore vaguely, like I was a kid when he was vice president. Why does he sound like this? Is this how he sounded in real life? Sound off in the comments. It is half man, half bear, and half pig. Okay, whatever. That's some Scott Steiner math right there. Man bear pig is very real, and he most certainly exists. I'm cereal. Man Bear Pig doesn't care who you are or what you've done. Man Bear Pig simply wants to get you. I'm super cereal. Bro, doesn't doesn't Cartman say that too? Super cereal or I'm cereal? No, never mind. I take that. Scratch that. Scratch. I won't edit it out. Uh, I just realized what Cartman says. Cartman says, um, I'm seriously. So not cereal, but whatever. Okay, thank you, Mr. Gore. <laughs> thank you, class. Excelsior! What the f is it? What? Pass it to me, Cartman. Hang on, I'm gonna do something super killer. God damn it, stop it, Kyle! You suck, bro. Oh. <laughs> Let's just see you get the ball this time, G Boy. Kyle, knock it off! Stop hugging the goddamn ball! Whoa! Bruh, are you serious worry, right now? It's not really Man Bear Pig. It's me, Al Gore. All right, so I'm convinced. Like, as a kid, he got, or as a baby, he got dropped on his head, and his mom didn't follow up with the doctor or anything like that. Because my man's is not 100 percent there, bro. You know what I mean? Is he like that in real life, or is this just how they, how they, how they make him out to be in the South Park world? Like they're trolling him. You feel me? Uh, Stan? Oh, hey, Dad. Hello. Did he just make a horse noise? <laughs> I think he just made a horse noise, bro. Hold on. It's, uh, getting late, boys. Why don't you get in the car and I'll drive you all home? Okay, Mr. Marsh. Be safe. Yo, he's a whole NPC, bro. What is he doing? Hello? Hello, this is Al Gore. Oh, man. Hi, Mr. Gore. Bro, it's past his bedtime, obviously, right? My man is sleeping. It's dark out. Why the f are y'all calling a little kid this late at night? Uh, look, I'm sorry, but we're all kind of busy. Oh, I get it. No! You don't believe me either. No, no, it's not that. Yes, it is. Nobody yeah, believes. there's definitely something wrong with him, bro. And he definitely does not have any friends, just like Stan said earlier. It's okay, Mr. Gore. I, I believe you. No, you don't. Yeah, I'm sure Man Bear Pig needs to be stopped. I'm just, I'm just scared that I can't do anything to stop him. Are you serial? Yes, I'm serial. Don't worry. We can stop him. Bring everyone nah, you can to that's Man Bear crazy. Pig tomorrow at 8 a.m. sharp. Like his change in attitude, bro. 180, complete 180, bro. We'll just make an appearance at his little meeting and then we'll go. Hi, kids. Come on in. Okay, let's get this meeting started. What do you kids think we should do to stop Mamba Pig? All right, so hold on, bro. 
at first I'm like, why are you inviting these kids to a, a motel? It's kind of it's kind of sus, right? It's kind of sketchy. But he does have a whole setup, so there might not be any ill will, any malicious intent behind them coming over. You feel me? Oh my god! Man bear pig screen active. What is this area of Colorado? It's a, it's a cave of some kind. Yeah, that's Cave of the Winds. It's a that can be comfortable, right? To be laying on your back to use the computer. Tourist attraction. Oh Jesus on ice skates. We've got to get down there right away. Jesus on ice skates is crazy. Welcome to Cave of the Winds. Our tour is going to take us through two chambers, one of the most elaborate cavern systems in Colorado. Before we get started, I do understand we have a special guest in our group today. The ex-vice president, Mr. Al Gore. No, bro. Anything to get out of school. They don't care about this guy. They don't believe in man, bear, pig. But just because he said, I'll get you out of school. They decided to, to, to go with him. Mr. Gore asked me to make sure you all knew he was here. Now, once <laughs> we enter the cave, we do ask you that you follow two rules. Stay on the path and do not touch anything. All right, are we ready? Yeah! yeah. I need you to keep an eye out for man bear pig droppings. What do man bear pig droppings look like? Similar to pig droppings, but more man bear like. <laughs> These drops often make interesting shapes, which we like to name. For instance, this one here we named the hanging mushroom. Hey, and yo. over here we have man with helmet and two bowling balls. <laughs> I, I. Sir, Mr. Gore, is there a problem? Not yet. Nah, son, nah. Just off, just off of that right there, bro. You can already tell my man needs, to, my man needs to be in class with Mimsy. Uh, what's the other kid's name? Nate, Nathaniel, and the other, the other kids in the science fair. You feel me? There's something wrong with this dude, one hundred percent. Mr. Gore, I think we should stay with the tour group. Wait. Shh. Christ, he's here! Take this rope! Be ready to tie him up! What? I've got you now, you son of a- What are you doing? Oh, no! No! Ah! You dumb Leave the idiot! Wall, you goddamn man bear pig! Ah! Bro, man -bear the pig kids! Oh my god! I hope, I hope their parents knew that they went out with Al Gore. I, I forgot the name of the place, bro, but I hope they know that they're out here looking for Man Bear Pig. No! Help! Forget Damn. it. They can't hear us. What are we gonna do? You better get us out of here. Me? You just had to go and be nice to Al Gore. Now we're trapped in a cave. Damn. Maybe there's another way out of here. Yeah, it, it kind of is his fault, bro, because he's the one that was super friendly to him. You know what I mean? But everybody else wanted to miss school so bad that they decided to go, you know what I'm saying, on this trip. So, yeah, it stands fault, but also you got to take some responsibility, too. Let's split up and look for a passageway. Everyone take a different direction. Oh, crap. If I miss dinner, I'm going to be so pissed off. He's mad as hell. Ah! Oh, okay, okay. Carmen, you see anything? No, nothing. No, nothing here. Nothing this way. He's about to be greedy as hell, bro. You guys go on ahead. I'm going to stay here. Wait it out. Why? I just, I don't feel very good. I just, I just weigh you guys down. No, we'll stay here too. If we start wandering off, we're going to get lost or killed. That's cool. I just, I just wouldn't go over there if I were you guys. I just took a huge dump. Yeah, he's been a greedy little. I'm afraid you have a much bigger problem than a cave in. What's that? What is that? A pig bear man? No, stupid. It's <laughs> Oh, that treasure. It's all mine. So long as these greedy don't find out about it. And they're going to hear him like, darn they. You'd love to get your hands on my treasure, wouldn't you? Even though I found it, you'd love to think it's somehow yours, too. Well, I've got news for you, Cap. You're never going to get my treasure. I've got a little plan going to get the treasure out of here without you ever knowing. Oh, shh. Oh, 
Hey, Kath. How's it going? Dude, what are you doing? Not much. You know, just hanging out. How you been, man? Good? Dude, get away from me. <laughs> yeah, nice talking with you, Kath. All right, so yeah. he didn't hear him, bro. I thought he heard him. Oh, no, that's dumb, bro. I oh, hear him. Dude, he's really sick. They have no idea. All right, people, we've got to work faster. Our best estimate still puts us three days away from reaching the area of the cave called Smuggler's Den. Smuggler's Den? It's a room near the end of the tour where you can get your picture taken with fake treasure. Here, see? No! Day outside. Curry about to be mad is bro, cause he's swallowing everything. My man's just eating all the coins, the the pearl necklaces, you know what I mean? Stan, Stan, wake up! Huh? What? Have they come for us? No, it's Cartman. Something's really wrong with him. <gasps> oh my god. god. Cartman? Dude, can you hear me? I'm fine. Bro, he's probably heavy-ish. I mean, he's already heavy-ish. But he's a whole lot heavier now, bro. All the coins he swallowed. Bro, he at least doubled in size. Come on, pull. Now, nah, they're strong as so though. You gotta, you gotta give him that. Hey, you guys. You gotta get me out of here. You guys, we got no time. I know y'all heard the coins. Bro, what are you doing? This is the end of you, man bear pig. Excelsior! What is that, Excelsior? Where, where, where is that from? Oh, shit. <laughs> Can't keep carrying him, dude. I've got no strength. Yes, you do. What the hell is that? Oh, bro, this dude flooded the damn oh cave. Uh, get me out of here! Get me out of here, you guys! Run! <gasps> and he got all the coins in him, so he's not gonna float. My man's gonna stay at the bottom after it gets filled up with water. You're calling off the rescue? We didn't plan on a freak river flood. God must really want those kids dead. <laughs> what if the children aren't dead? Look, the cabin is completely flooded. Nothing could have survived. There's nothing left alive down there. Damn. Guy right here, bro. Like, I can't even say his name because YouTube is going to take it the wrong way. You feel me? Kimmy, here, take my hand. Hurry, Kyle, the water's rising. Damn. As much as these two hate each other, right? Look who's coming to the rescue. Look who's making sure that Cartman is straight. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's being a real one right now, right now, bro. Kyle is that dude. He's not letting him go. We are gathered here to say goodbye to four kids whom we all tried to help, but in the end could not. But where there is loss, there is hope. And we will never forget the names of the brave young kids who lost their lives. Kid one. <laughs> Kid two. <laughs> and how kid two was always oh. there when I needed it. It's Stan, bro. They made it. Kids, I saved you. Stay away from us, asshole. Right. I was nice to you because I felt sorry for you because you don't have any friends. But now I see why you don't have any friends. You just use Man Bear Pig as a way to get attention for yourself because you're a loser. Ooh. We need to get our friend to a hospital right away. No. No, I'm fine. I just need to get home and rest. Cartman, seriously, you need to see a doctor. No, I just need to get to a toilet. See you guys. I have it. Oh, hell no. Nah. You saw the doodle that came out of that first? Did Cartman just crap treasure? It's mine. It's mine, you hear me? I got it out of the cave. It belongs to me. Keep your greedy hands away. Hey, that looks like the fake treasure from our smuggler's den photo room. That's right. Oh, I, he told him. He told yeah, him. Yeah, we put it there for kids to take their picture with. 
All in all, I'd say that treasure's worth about $14. <laughs> 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 Damn, son. Don't you think I'm hurting enough, cow? Yeah, that's gotta hurt, though. Well, my work here is done. Excelsior! Bro, I really thought he was gonna take Ex off. Nah, this was tough, bro. This was good. I like that. I enjoyed that. It was different. But y'all gotta fill me in on Al Gore, because that dude was. That dude was something else. Weird as hell. You know what I'm saying? But listen, man, I appreciate you pulling up and watching this video with me. If you enjoyed it, you know what to do. Go ahead and smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button if you haven't yet. And join the family. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.